Hi guys, so today I'm going to work on week 43 and 44. I just combined two videos together because while doing my week 43, my camera dies and I didn't even notice. So it was a short video, so I just combined them. And also I'm going to be doing my giveaway as promised. I have reached 500 plus subscribers, so um, keep watching so you know what the giveaway is. Anyways, um, as you saw, I just put down my washi tape and now I'm just going to read through what I have going on throughout the week and add my doodles and um, some stickers. Um, I put down the heart washi tape because this week is my daughter's birthday, so I wanted to make this week kind of special and about her. And I don't know if I've mentioned this before, I probably did. But um, I use Paper Loving Mommy stickers. They fit really well in my Hobonichi, and that's why I enjoy them and use them. I wish they would make, Etsy's full of stickers, um, but they don't make them small enough for the Hobonichi. So if anyone's watching and you make stickers, contact me, I want small stickers. Uh, for my Hobonichi. They're all for the big planners and it's really hard to find them. So anyway, back to my layout. I just added that stamp and I wrote in my son's ortho or my daughter's ortho um, appointment. And uh, I have these old, old stamps. Um, they're birthday stamps or monster birthday stamps. And I wanted to use the stars around my daughter's birthday day um, and I'm going to around this time my camera dies and you won't get me you won't get to see me stamp this half circle on my stamp or sorry on my planner or add her picture uh, that kind of ticked me off but I um, I did add a picture of her I printed that on my zip printer and I'll add happy birthday with these cute gold alphas and I will add 12 with um, <clears throat> these really cute uh, cork numbers I'm just adding my flags this is me trying to explain that I filled that out with my markers my zig markers so anyway I move to my November calendar and I'm gonna put down some uh, washi tape and if you guys have noticed, I don't go with um, themes. I, I love fall colors, so I stick to the fall colors, but I'm not the type of person that's gonna be putting, um, you know, Halloween stickers or um, Thanksgiving stickers and all that stuff. I, I like my planner to be as simple as possible, and, um, and I enjoy it like that. I love seeing people adding, you know, all those cool stickers and themes and all that it's beautiful but I don't know why I just don't like it for my own planner if that makes any sense uh, anyway as you saw I cut those leaves out of washi tape that I have I wish I showed you guys that washi tape but I forgot and I just cut those leaves out and stuck them on my Thanksgiving day um, and I want to stamp out November so it's just trying it out on the side. I love these stamps, they're really small and they fit really well in the Hobonichi. So, um, and I, they're from um, Kelly Perky's stamps. So I added that and I'm just going to fill out my doodles and uh, add some stamps. So I'm done with my November calendar and I'm going to move to week 44. Um, week 44, let's see, um, it's Halloween week. So I'm decided to 
stamp Halloween with my small um, alpha stamps. And I know by now that it's not going to fit, but I'm hoping for a miracle, I guess. <laughs> anyway, halfway through, um, I decide, okay, I have to cover it up. It didn't work. I was hoping for, or it's not going to work as I was hoping for. So um, I go ahead and look for through my um, labels and I find this one and stick it down and I'm gonna find some alphas and the alphas I use actually work out really well because they kind of um, like all over the place kind of alphas I don't even know how to explain it and um, it worked well so um, sometimes mistakes happen and you just have to cover it up and move on anyway I um, will stamp a crow right there. I'm also going to add the number 50 to that square because it's my parents' 50th anniversary. Um, yes, my parents have been together for 50 years and they're amazing role models for all of us. So I added that and I'm going to put down my washi tape which I forgot to do earlier. Um, I think I'm just going to start doodling, adding my stickers the usual. So I'm also going to go through this sticker book and add um, my weekend sticker. Um, I decided to stamp a pumpkin and um, I wanted to use this new ink that I got. Uh, it's like an ombre black and gray and silver I guess, or a lighter shade of gray. So I stamped it first just to kind of remove a little bit of the ink, I didn't want it to bleed through. And I stamp it and it actually worked really well and I'm also gonna stamp from that same stamp set uh, I think it said like spooky and scary um, I did make a mess because my hands were not well were, were full of ink so I'm gonna cover that up I didn't really like how it looked but <clears throat> it's okay it's just a planner that's my motto and I'm going to um, kind of use my zig markers, fill out my doodles, and color around that crow and uh, blend it in. So I do have close-up pictures um, in the end of uh, this video, but if you guys enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Um, I do appreciate every single one of you, and stay tuned for the giveaway. Okay guys, as I promised, um, this is my giveaway. It starts today, ends November 11th. I will announce the winner on the 14th of November. I'm giving away a Hobonichi Weeks and sticker sheet. You have to be over the age of 18 to enter. And um, also, this is only for my US subscribers. I'm sorry guys. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, or be a subscriber. Leave a comment down below. You could tell me about how you want this Hobonichi or why you love your Hobonichi, but you have to leave a comment down below so I know that you entered. And um, good luck, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. And don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe and enter this giveaway. Good luck, guys. Bye.